Hi, Yvette. How are you today? I'm good. How That's are you? Great. I'm good. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Are you ready for these questions? I'm as ready as I'm going to get. Okay. Are you ready for the answers? Because, right. you know, I, I can say some shit. Okay. Okay. All right. So, my first question is, how have your pro your life priorities changed over time? Oh. Ooh. How my life priorities changed over time? Um... Now that I'm 40, I can remember being younger and I wanted to be famous. Like I wanted to be a celebrity and just be famous and have the world love me. But now that I'm older, I, I'd rather just have quiet. I'd rather have quiet. I don't care about fame. The money would be nice, but I... I, my priority is just I like quiet, I like peace I like good energy I like serenity, I like stuff like that as before I wanted the everything that came with being famous being known but over time I realized that's not important and I like my privacy so my priority changed from wanting to be known and everybody know me to please leave me alone, just I'd rather have quiet and and the, the beautiful things that come with peace and serenity. So that's how it's changed from thoughts at 20 versus me at 40 now. So that's how it changed. Okay. Um, what makes you feel empowered? Damn. Oh. Damn. What makes me feel empowered? Mm. Uh, I think my creativity makes me feel empowered um, me making people laugh makes me feel empowered because I feel like if once I make you smile I make you laugh I'm like yeah I'm a conquered world now I'm good but my, my creativity definitely makes me feel empowered because that's something I can control there's a lot of things in life I haven't been able to control but my creativity is definitely something that I can control at any given time. I could create something. I could not create something. I can be in 100% control of that dynamic. So I would say my creativity and the fact that I, I say stuff and make people laugh, talk mad shit and people laugh. So yeah, that. Okay. What is the most misunderstood thing about you? <laughs> <laughs> um, gosh. the most misunderstood thing about me I think oh gosh, I think the most misunderstood thing about me is that I'm nice and most of the time like 80% of the time people see me I'm happy I'm nice and I'm happy and people think I never get mad or I won't snap off like if you know me you know I will snap off you know I got a temper you know I get mad but I think people just think I'm so nice that they don't have to they can do or say whatever and there's no consequence and I think that's part of it so I think that's the most misunderstood thing. People are like, oh, she's so nice. Oh, she so got a temper and will go there with you. Don't play with me. I think that's like the most misunderstood thing, I think. Okay. Well, thank you for answering our three questions today, Yvette. That was it? That three. was it. Oh, okay. You only get three. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> Have a good day. <laughs> Alrighty then. <laughs>